Well, I live in Hickory. Uh, I'm a furniture designer and also a painter. Uh, I'm originally from Augusta, Georgia, uh, but my family moved up here in the late 60s uh, to Hickory. And uh, I've lived many places in between there, but we're back in Hickory and we also split our time between there and Blowing Rock, which is where I do the majority of the paintings that you'll see. Uh, the mountains have been very important to me. Uh, love the mountains, I love the light of the mountains and also the, the nature that, that surrounds us and uh, that's uh, pretty much the inspiration for this whole show. This show is primarily of the forest interiors uh, that surround uh, the small lakes near Blowing Rock. Uh, many of the trees that you'll see, I do a lot of trees uh, that were from the mountains um, near Asheville and also Blowing Rock and Boone. Uh, I've begun to paint uh, rock structures, uh, table rock. Uh, you, can't, you can't have a show in Morganton without painting a painting of table rock. I spent a lot of time on Table Rock uh, when I was a child, uh, hiking, climbing, uh, and I love it. Love the chimneys. The paintings that you'll see are either oil on canvas or acrylic on canvas. Uh, the ones on oil are also stretch over board because uh, when I paint, oftentimes I will, I will build the surface up and I will sand it back down, uh, building up many layers of paint and also glazing uh, somewhere in between. Uh, this painting right here is a good example of, of the glazing technique. Uh, it gives it an overall kind of light. Uh, it gives it a depth that uh, just painting on the paint on the surface can't give. I think when painting is really good, uh, painting is about obsession. Uh, if the painter is not obsessed uh, with some aspect of, of their craft, uh, their vision, then the paintings get a little bit boring. Um, and so uh, having said that, I, I think when, when the painter is obsessed, it shifts their focus towards one thing and they push that one element in their work. Uh, for me, uh, of course, there's nature, but it's also the light. The light's been very important to me my entire life. And when my, when my paintings work, when I think they're really working, the, the light becomes very important. 